Pragya, hi. Uh, this is Sanjay, and uh, your mother is here. So she's won this crown, you know, today. And she's uh, put in a lot of effort. And uh, we're just standing behind this ba uh, banner, which says, Dreams Come Alive. So how do you feel when she was winning the title? I, I had no doubt she's going to win a title here. Okay, what is the reason? Why are you so confident about it? Look at her. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's all the answers. I'm so proud of her. It's I lovely. And uh, are you also going to, uh, means, have you any time participated in the BB pageant? I did when I was younger, but that's not my cup of tea. Not now. Say. Okay, maybe a little later. Maybe. As, as your mama told me that she is into building of pigeons and yep. she's going to go to Rajasthan. Correct. So maybe we are going to follow her there. Probably. Right. <laughs> so wish you all the best to both of you. Thanks, ma'am. Uh, good evening, friends. Uh, today we have uh, the, the second runner, right? Mrs. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. I would say Miss because we used to miss so much. So she is a lady. She's a working woman. She's Rashmi and she hails from Pune. So Pune is ideally the city for IT, but as she told me that she has to do a lot of things. So how was the uh, winning movement when you were asked to come uh, on the 8th and then finally on the 3rd? Yeah, it was beautiful. Actually, it was like dreams come true. So I was just waiting and when the name finally announced, it was something, okay, wow, it is finally true and I am on the stage and I am amongst the winners. So I was really, very happy. Yeah, and what would your family, your husband, I have a was he there today? My husband was not there, but okay. my daughter is here to support me. Okay. And it was really nice to have somebody around to you. Uh, no matter my husband was not here definitely, but without his support, I would have not been here. So yeah, I do have. So you have taken his permission. I, I would not, not say permission, but yeah, it's kind as, of, as yes. a husband and wife, we work together as a team, yes. and it's always yeah. nice to motivate somebody to live their dreams. So like he's an army officer, and he has never uh, asked me not to live my dream. So that's how I'm, at 50 also I am here living my dream. That's great. Yeah. And uh, today uh, this yes, title. Yes. You know, we we'll give you some responsibility because the brand Hey Lakshmi is such a good brand. It's a very good brand. And then Mrs. India 2020. So you've got responsibility as a nation. So what do you want to do in the coming years? As I am into education definitely and nurturing young minds to making them aware of their responsibility at a very early age is a very important task of our we educators. So uh, giving them the correct knowledge and in imparting the correct way of thinking in our process. As a teacher I feel that will be my utmost responsibility as well as encouraging women to come forward uh, and also start living their own. As as a woman, we always keep ourselves second and we take to make sure that our family, our children are happy. But I feel if a woman herself is happy, she'll make everybody else happy too. Right. And you uh, seem to be uh, tall for your height. So what's your height? I'm five seven and a half. Five seven and a half. Okay. And what sports have you been playing to I get this good uh, ideal height? You know? Okay. Because I would say uh, some part of it is for my genes as well. Right. I had a very tall head father, and I do play badminton and as also I also play basketball. Yeah. My question was because uh, today uh, we realized that because of our internet. And over WhatsApp and then the Corona. Yeah. So the children or most of us, even, you know, we are just trying to be indoors. So we don't go outdoors. This was an outdoor event, I think, first after the pandemic, almost. So thank you, uh, ma'am. And we wish you all the best and all the success in your life. Thank you so much. Yeah. Nice talking to you. I just, yeah.